Hey everyone, my name is Sean Arnold and today I'm bringing you another parallel quest guide or a Z rank guide on for our parallel quest in Dragon Ball Z Universe. The, today's parallel quest is number 50, Parent and Child, a quest which you can only get to once you've done the Time Chasm Crystal Shard quest. If you haven't done that quest line yet but you've beaten the main story, have a look at some of the more recent guys that I've been doing um, to get those Time Crystal Shards so you can complete that quest. Anyway, this is a really fun mission, although I'm not too sure if the rewards are anything special. I've got Rebellion Spare, I haven't tried it though, so yeah, whatever. Now, Parent and Child has the two, has two hidden win conditions. The first one is to clear it in 10 minutes, and then the second one is to fight against Bardock, Raditz, and Goku. It says clear it in 10 minutes, but I'm going to try and do it in 5 minutes. I just seem to have more success when I do it in 5 minutes rather than 10 minutes. Um, in terms of preparation for this mission, you don't really need anything special, although you may want to bring some health items, just because you're going to be fighting many enemies simultaneously, and if you're doing it solo like I do, you can take a bit of a whooping. Anyway, let's get started with parent and child. Okay, so at the start of the mission, you'll be fighting against Trunks, Videl, and Gohan. What I want you to do at the beginning of this mission here is to try and use some type of attack, preferably an ultimate, which can reduce these numbers against you into something a bit more manageable. Your best target going first is fighting Videl because she has the least amount of health, and then Trunks and then Gohan in that order. Now where is Videl? Uh, hopefully I can get her in Blue Hurricane, I really don't want to fight Gohan, and that didn't work at all, so let's wait for Videl to get closer to me and do this one more time. Where is she? She should be around there somewhere, there's Videl. So hopefully that will kill her off. And now let's get Trunks a bit. Let's chip him out a bit. Now with Trunks and Gohan a bit just left, this should be a bit more manageable. So I'm going to try and do some evaluation criteria here. The first one I'm going to do is Grappler. To get Grappler, you need to do three throws in a match. And um, it doesn't matter who you do the throws on. As long as you've done three, you'll get Grappler. The next one I'm going to do here is Super User. Super User, to get Super User, you just have to do 10 Supers in a fight. And um, so I'm just going to rotate between the two enemies here, keep locking them down. You don't have to do it like this, but this works well for me. Just keep locking them down, rotating between the two. Watch out for any evasive skills that Shrugs just used. And um, yeah, just keep them managed really, really well. Now I'm out of key, so I want to build a bit more here. I'm going to charge up a bit more, up, back up a bit. Maybe it'd be good to fly away. Let's see, I could go around Capsule Corp if I wanted to, but... Um, it's going to be difficult to get key like this. So I have a move here, an evasive skill called Angry Shout. Now Angry Shout can be really, really useful because it hits enemies, but it also gives you key in the process if you hit them. The first one, sorry, that was my phone beeping there. Probably got a tweet or something. Um, so let's do some more super attacks on Trunks. Uh, let's do another one there. I don't know how many I've done. I've kind of lost count here. And I want to speed this up a little bit, so I think in the next time I get 300 key, I'm going to kill Trunks off, and I'm just going to fight Gohan at this point. Because, uh, yeah, he's getting on my nerves. Look at the, all these key blast. Let's use Angry Shout again, get a bit of breathing space, and Trunks is where? Where are you, boy? There he is. Let's just trap him in the blue hurricane, and there we go. Now, before fighting Gohan, I want to do a nice combo to him, but first I need a bit more stamina. That should be good, but I need a bit more than that. I want to get a 20 hit combo on him. To do that, I'm going to use Meteor Crash. Uh, so watch out for any evasive moves that he has there. Uh, let's use Meteor Crash. Hopefully I can get up to 20. That's good. With 20 hits, you get the combo Adept criteria. So now at this point here, I'm going to kill off Gohan and finish up this part here. I could do more super attacks if I wanted to, but I kind of want to get to the next area within 5 minutes. And I've kind of used about half the time so far. If you have taken a bit of a beating, you could use items here to heal yourself up. And also, be on the lookout. Sometimes NPCs will spawn here, Trunks and Goten. Have a talk to them because Trunks will give you an item. So he's giving me an equip item, which is always nice and helpful. Very generous of him, considering I just beat him up. And Goten will heal you, so it's a bit of a waste that I just used that item. You could have a look around for more items. If you can get 5 items within a mission, you will get Treasure Hunter, but it doesn't happen very often for me. Usually I only get about 1 or 2 items spawning, so don't worry about that too much. Okay, the next area is a bit pretty much the same, but you want to be on the ball here because Vegeta and Goku are very aggressive. Kill Hercule as soon as you can, and then try to take out Goku and or Vegeta. If you want to leave one of them to stay alive, you could, I suppose, try to get more evaluation criteria on them. 
But um, I don't want to waste too much time. Goku is almost dead here. So I'm going to hopefully finish him off. And hopefully I've got done enough to get to the next secret part. Which I have. So have a look around this area. This could be an opportunity to get more items if you want to. There's two over there. If I can see one more, I'll get... Yep, there's one more. So I can get Treasure Hunter with this. Which will help me towards my Z rank. So I'm going to pick up these items here. Including the equip item I got from Trunks. And the one I got in the last area. At Capsule Corp. That will make five, so that will do treasure hunter. So I'm going to pick these up here, and I will cut to... I'll see you guys in the next area of this mission. Okay, you probably noticed before, but the next gate is actually back at Capsule Corp. So you have to go back through here. Um, I don't know if you can talk to the NPCs again. Let's see if I can talk to Goto and get healed. No, you can't do anything here. So you just want to move on. Head to the next area when you're ready. Make sure your key and stamina is high. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, in this area you'll be fighting against Raditz and Bardock. Beat up Raditz a little bit and Goku will soon spawn. And then you just want to try and kill them ASAP. Raditz is the easiest target here. He doesn't have a lot of health, so let's chip him out. And then we've got to deal with Bardock and Goku. Blue Hurricane works really, really well for dealing with these two enemies because they like to be aggressive and charge at you quite a bit. But um, if it doesn't work, you might just have to beat them up the old passion way. So um, hopefully I can kill one of them with a blue hurricane. Let's see if I can take out Goku here. Probably won't be enough to kill him, but we'll see how much it does. Yeah, it's not enough to kill him. Um, yeah, he's still got quite a bit of health left. So let's do another one, and then I just want to focus on Bardock, and that will be it for this mission here. Don't really need to do much else. I'm just going to kind of do this as quickly as I can. Um, I could do some more super attacks, I suppose. I could play around with Bardock. But I'm not going to waste time. I'm just going to wrap it up here. And hopefully I've done enough to get a Z rank. Maybe, maybe not. We'll soon see. So, um, yeah, one more of these will do to Bardock. And job should be done. Right, there's the ultimate finish. So let's see what has happened. And there you have it. Managed to get the Z rank. So just to go through that, outnumbered. Fought by yourself. Treasure Hunter picked up five items. No sweat. You can get no sweat really easy if you have health items. All you got to do is just make sure your health is nice and high before you finish a mission. Accurate speaks for itself. Grappler. Combo Adept, as I spoke before, 20 hits. Ultimate user, five, uh, I used ultimate attacks five times. Super user, I did manage to get it, fortunately. Ultimate attack finish. Expert exhibitionist, that's, that, that's getting five, killing five enemies with ultimate attacks. Expert vanquisher, vanquisher great, quest great success. So, uh, hopefully this guide has been useful to some of you. If so, please leave a like. It's really, really appreciated and really, really helpful to know and get feedback from you guys as what kind of content you are enjoying. Um, please leave a comment if you have anything to say. I'm around 24 hours a day and always ready to hear your comments, even if it's just to say hi or ask any questions. I will never buy. I'm always here for you guys. And um, yeah, please subscribe, obviously, as people like to say. Subscribe for more content. And also take part in the vote, which is going to t um, come after this video plays. Um, just a little way of having a bit more fun and hopefully making this entertaining for you guys. So anyway, that's enough of prattle for me. I'm waffling. Uh, let me wrap up the video there. Thank you as always for being a support. Much love. Take care and goodbye. Congratulations. You made it all the way to the end of my video. So just for you, just for you, we're going to have a new character battle for this week. Last week, I posed a question to you all. Which transformation from the new Dragon Ball Z movie, Revival of Frieza, do you want to see the most? And with a whopping 100% of the votes, Smurf Goku took away the prize for that battle. Sorry Frieza, you're not going to be able to beat Goku this time. This time I want to propose a different type of question to you fine folks out there. When it comes to the ladies, which bee do you prefer? No, not those type of bees. I'm talking brains or brawn. Bulma, the smartest woman on earth, or Chi Chi, the strongest mother on earth. Who do you vote for? Click on a picture right now to submit your vote and I will tally up the results and put them into a video next week.